What is up everybody? This is Atticus the Death Metal and for this video we got ourselves our very special guest. Say hello to my friend down under, Shady Corner. How's it going? It's all good there, mate. So what are we talking about today, my friend? Well, I figured I would, uh, you know, talk to you about this certain situation that your country's biologists, environmentalists have gotten planned for a certain invasive species. Well, yeah, we, before I, before I read this article, I just want to say, like, when we, when we have something that comes up, you know, here, uh, we either don't give a fuck, and we just turn around, we just look at each other and we say, cunts fuck, or we just, like, do the most stupidest shit. And I think at this particular moment, we're doing some pretty fucking crazy shit. Uh, so the article which you sent me, um, which did not surprise me at all, because nothing surprises me here in Australia anymore. Uh, the Australian government recently announced an unusual initiative to eradicate a long-standing animal pest problem. And it's not the cane toad, but we will get to that. Uh, to rid the streams and rivers of invasive European carp crowding the native freshwater species, officials plan to begin introducing a strain of herpes uh, to the water, basically, into the fish population. Uh, yeah, that's a thing. Fucking fish herpes! I mean, when I read this article, I was like, herpes? <laughs> Just fucking... Fucking... Well, I mean, there, there are invasive European species, so they're, of course, a, uh, a shitlord species from Europe, so might as well... Just check their privilege hardcore style, am I right, man? Oh yeah, definitely. But you, you know what the you know what the biggest problem is? Is that we have such strict fishing laws over here. Like our fishing laws are fucked. You can't like it's it's like if you get too many fi like way too many fish, I'm talking like like four or five fish, they're like, no no no, put them back. All you have to do for one weekend, if you don't want to just add fucking, you don't want to tip a little cup of herpes in the water, is you just let us fish, because Australia is known for sitting around doing nothing and fishing with our dicks. Do you want to fucking finish me off, mate? If you let us fish for a weekend, the problem will be eradicated for fucking free, mate. It's effective. It's super effective. I mean... Like, here in America, especially in the Mississippi River, we have this major problem with the Asian carp. Yo, yeah, oh, we're, we're totally racist towards these Asian carps and stuff, but no, aside from all this, you know, jokes aside, when it comes to invasive species, they really damage the ecosystems. They really majorly fuck up the ecosystems. And, you know, we've, we've tried a lot of things. We try, you know, um, cutting them off from, like, you know, dams. We tried doing other this, trying to take them out. But didn't really work. It didn't really work. And the Asian carp, they're pretty much just driving out the native species. So what do we do? We do what all of us supreme evil, like, specious shitlords do. We basically fish them and eat them. Though carp... I mean, the carp is just, it's, it tastes muddy, it tastes earthy, sort of like, you know, like a catfish, but like way worse than a catfish, because I've had catfish before, but when it comes to, you know, an invasive species, you got to eat them the fuck out in order to save the native species, like, um, sturgeon or paddle nose fish. I mean, because they, they're getting fucked up, for sure. And it, it, it's it's literally fucked that way. Not to mention we have the snake heads, and I've told you, Shady, about the snake heads. Jesus Christ, these fuckers are insane. See, I think the problem that we have is, and I think what they're sitting around and doing is they're going, you know what? All this shit that we have, we've had cane toads, and now we've had these. They all taste like shit. And the way I would say it would be that because we're Australia, uh, to any scientist who doesn't want to eat something that tastes like shit, harden the fuck up because you're in Australia, mate. And you should just probably just like fish and eat the fish. 
or do it for sport like most of us do. Uh, but hey, I'm not. I'm not saying don't tip the herpes in the water, but I'm saying it's pretty fucked up and weird. Like, like it, it's up there. It's up there on the scale of like, what the fuck, Australia? What are we doing? I, I couldn't agree with you there. I couldn't agree with you there more, especially when it comes to cane toads. Because I remember, I'm a bizarre foods junkie, and what I have seen on an episode of Bizarre Foods was that like you know Andrew Zimmern found out that you know most of the guys that you know collect up all the cane toads, since you know cane toads are ven venomous, they find out creative ways into actually eat doing like a sort of toad legs or frog legs sort of sense to get all the poisons out of the system because i mean most native species cannot eat cane toads because they're they're fucking poisonous as shit oh yeah like we had people we had people dying from cane toads when we had the problem here like it was a uh it was one of those things where and and this come and this comes down to the whole like generalization of when we had the whole Johnny Depp incident happen recently. Oh god, Johnny Depp and his dogs. <laughs> Where, yeah, when he tried to bring his fucking dogs in Australia, and he's like, no, 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 I'm better than anyone else. And we're like, mate, did you, like, I mean, I'm not saying you should know about the cane toad situation, but uh, there is a reason why we have laws like that, that you cannot bring shit like that into the country. I, it, it's, yeah, those laws are just pretty stupid and stuff. But I, I'm kind of, like, a little bit curious on how this whole fish herpes thing is going to come out. I mean, like, I just, for instance, I'm just thinking, like, just some really crazy death metal song. Like, fish herpy death. Just like fish, your disgusting invasive fish. Covered in genital herpes, clogging up the waters to die. <laughs> oh my god, I just thought of Mermaider. <laughs> Alright, but in a... But in a sense, like... Australia, learn from us. Look, look. If you got, if you got a few notes, send them our way. It's not necessarily we're gonna read them because you know we're pretty like, you know, we we can't be fucked. But like, look, because that's Australia's motto. We can't be fucked most of the time, and cunts fucked is usually number two. But look, send us some notes, and I'll run them by whichever fucked up piece of shit came up with the whole putting a, a rabbit herpes fucking infested fish in the water. Yeah, because, like, if you put down a strain of herpes in a, a stream of fish, it's going to take, like, a couple years. For us in America, it's going to take, like, a couple weeks or months just to diminish an invasive species population just by eating them. Learn recipes. Learn how to eat them in a very proper way. I mean, that's how we've been doing this for thousands of years when it came to eating out of necessities and stuff. So that's just my whole two cents. Any last words, Shady, before we end this? I'd say, um, this pro again, this probably isn't the weirdest thing that Australia has done, but I'd say it's pretty up there. And to be honest with you, the fact that this has made the news... Bravo, Australia. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I think I think we're done here. Without further ado, ladies and gents, I am Atticus, the Death Meddler. Hope you like this video. Subscribe to my channel. Links are in the description below. Make sure to check out my buddy from Down Under, Shady Corner. He has some really awesome content. Really great guy. Just down-to-earth person in general. Keep it metal. Have a wonderful day.